the first set of dictators we, we came across with were actually parents in mm. this part of the world. We were told as children that we, we, we shouldn't have voices, we can't speak. You can't ask child questions. Has, you, you can't ask questions. They'll say you are a stubborn child, you are not well behaved and all of that. And then we grew up into teenage, we went to school, teachers did the same thing to us, they shut down our voices. Our reli we have religious uh, rulers also doing the same thing. And then when we become adults, we, we just replace our parents with government and we mm. expect that we shouldn't speak out. So, so you work. really are hopeful Absolutely. about Nigeria. You're if, not one of those that have given no, up. No, you no, look no. at the it Boko is, Haram. Die, yeah. You look at Boko Haram. You look at cultists. You look at all the issues that if we're going If they are not getting tired, we are not going to get tired. We die here. And I we live, die we here. We die here. Not be smart. <laughs> That's why we all speak English. Eh? Me, I drop the English for one side. You see this country where we get now. All of us get uh, their papa. They oppress our own papa. Then they they go come oppress or come oppress our children. children. I don't want to happen now. I say to people, no, this country we can work for. If the people who are giving bad governance are not getting tired, how dare we say we are going to get tired? What did we do? I mean, I mean, wait, so I looked at continue. Hey, we don't continue. We start. We day here. No. Mm. No, no, no retreat, no surrender. We are not. We know they go leave. This is our country, hundred percent Niger, and we must make sure that this country works.